I just thought of something. I've been sitting here catching all these fish today and I haven't let you guys have a chance to catch anything. So I've come back to the start, to the beginning. This is where I first started catching them pretty good on a square bill. But I've also changed up. I can't let myself and that one rod, the CU double, have all the fun. So I've rigged up, there's actually one right here, four different square bills. We got what, the one we just picked up. Last week I tried this one, it was doing good. And we do have just enough cloud cover when the cloud hides, that gold may still work. I've taken the uh, lingle off, put it on the, the Tomo, Toma, Tomo, Toma. I uh, took my Black Knight 2, stuck it on the Zephyr. We're going to try out that little crank, and it was working also when those two were. So anyway, you guys are going to get a chance to catch a bass. What do you think? I know. I know. That's how I am. I'm going to let you guys do it. So let's go. Whoa! you guys see that it came off I thought I had felt like a big fish oh it caught other line that's what happened look at that I was gonna say this thing is very good about getting through wood but it felt solid I thought it was a fish the way it hit but that line kind of gave finally somebody's out here fishing with crazy thick line that is junk See that hook? That is a catfish. That's like an old jet. Wow, that stainless has lasted forever. Little circle hook. It's almost like the hooks on the uh, treble. This one treble bait we used had. So anyway, when you get this, don't throw it back in the water. Wad it up. Throw it in the trash when you get a chance. Technically, that hook could be used again for guys that use those kind of hooks, but I'm just wadding it all up For now, I'm gonna throw it in the cup holder over here Get out of there. I'm trying to catch a fish All right, good job. Let's go Get all the way out there There we go, we got a fish. Oh, he come off. No way. He's still there. He's come running at me so hard, I lost track of him. Good job. I gave up. I thought he was gone. You guys never let up. You guys kept him in. That little sucker must have charged so hard that, like, I thought, I don't know, you guys kept reeling. I thought he got off. I saw the rod, like, the, you know, it unloaded, and I was like, nah, he got off. But nope. Way to stick, way to stick it out, way to fight it out. Good job, good bait. I told you this bait catches. Look at that monster you guys caught. You want to pick beside that one? No, okay, I understand. No pick with that guy. Let's keep going. All right, you can't keep a good bait down. No need to put it down, keep throwing it. Whoa, you guys went a little off on that one. Okay, we'll just run it out, see what it does. Try him out there. Oh, I see what we're gonna have to slow down you guys are reeling too fast it is so shallow here now that it's just it's just too shallow you guys are bumping bottom even way out there let's try one in closer with this bait whoa yeah let's try that shot reel it slow hold the rod tip even if you're worried about getting too shallow even sometimes hold it up like that and then just reel slower give it little short twitches if you're getting too you know getting bogged down and you don't want to mess with switching baits cast that baby out keep your rod tip up I learned that with the uh, dig it rod tip up just real steady until you feel something then stop okay we felt something pop it off Pop it off again. Rod tip up. Kind of let you work across the top of that dead grass. All right. Well, it caught us a bass. Let's do, let's just turn around and try it over here. It did catch a bass over there. Throwing into the wind. Able, good shot. 
Oh! Oh! You kidding me? You guys missed that. That fish hit you guys twice and you missed it. You blame the tip of the freaking Zephyr, I guess. That was a two shot wonder. Had two chances to set that hook. Let's try that again. Whoa. All right, let it set. Now real. Okay, we may be on something here. They may be staged up. Oh, got one right there, boys. Oh, you guys got a good one. You got a good fish. Is that a catfish? No. Them bass are so white, they look like a freaking channel. Oh, my God, you guys got him. Whoa, easy. Keep him away from the boat. You don't want to let it. The oh, look at that turtle. Hey, turtle. We caught one. Can the Zephyr? Oh, sure it can. Sure, the Zephyr can't really boat flip. You guys caught a giant. We're going to get a pick of this one. I want you guys to be smiling in this pick. That. I'm telling you guys, that bait's legit too. You know, of course, it's a Bagley's. Bagley's, all Bagley baits are legit. Even the Bagley little, uh... oh shoot, shaky head jigs. They make decent ones. I'm not even sure if they make them or third party. Whatever. Anyway, let's get a pick. Let's get a shot first of this. And then we are, we are into a little spot here. Usually I anchor down, you don't do any good. Look how white that bass is. Look at that shot. Excellent. Excellent. Oh, okay. Look at that. Got a pick. You want to see if he'll jump? You guys try to make him jump. I'm not good at it anymore. You guys see if you can make that fish jump. Come on. That fish is dead. You guys killed it. You guys killed him. Come on. Oh, man. Head shake. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Get out of here. Go bass a bonsai. And whatever you do, have fun doing it. I'm gone.